All right, we're here with Chris from True Gray. He's the owner from True Gray. And this is a sheer pleasure. And uh, tell us a little about history about your company, Chris. Uh, we're from, uh, I've been in the industry for over 25 years now. Basically, the only thing I know is tuna. Right. Um, started as a kid, unloading tuna boats, grazing tuna. Right. And trying to figure out, it's, it's, it's complicated with tuna. It's not that easy. Everybody thinks the red is the better. That's not true. Right. A tuna can be red, but not good. Okay. Because the lactic acid could have set in the meat of the fish, the fish is going to turn fast. Okay. If it makes any sense. Sure. Um, if you want to step, we'll step outside. Okay. And we'll this fish together. All right, let's do, do that. Yeah, definitely. has a T-tail right. bloodline. Yes. And then the big eye has no bloodline. Okay. Okay, so that shows the difference there. That's just a straight two plus. Two plus, one. How can you tell that's a one? One minus. Back one second. This is a one, you see the clear translucence? Very red, very translucent. You can see through the, the plug. Okay, yep. It is very red. This being a one minus, a color a little bit less, but a very translucent plug. Okay. 2G76, not quite a plus, but not quite a two. 2G82, the tail looks very nice, but the plug is not very clear. It's kind of foggy, which tells me that lactic acid is set in that meat. Okay. And lactic acid is the same as like citric acid. Okay. You know when you make ceviche? Yes. Ceviche cooks the meat. Or lemon lemon juice cooks the meat. Right. Citric acid cooks the meat. Okay. You know what I mean? This fish is good two plus. One one minus. This looks like it has cancer. Two plus strong. <laughs> see the meat? Yeah. Kind of cloudy in there. Yeah. No. Well, you see this? How it's way. Okay. There's some type of cancer or some group, and the, and the meat itself, if you feel it, it feels really spongy. Okay. Not very nice. Plus strong, 120. One minus, 99. Plus strong, 115. Plus strong, 68. Plus 71. Plus 98. 280. 2G90, 2G106, 2G99, or 79, 273, 2G89, this fish are horrible, 2G92, 2, 153, 298, see how they got some brown in it? Yeah. It's just not that nice. Sure. And you always grade out here in the daylight? Yeah, it's the best light. <coughs> I always use daylight. Okay. If I try to go and grade inside the fluorescent bulbs, right. it always makes the fish look better than it really is. Okay. And then when your consumer gets it on the plate, it's a totally different story. It looks like shit. Okay. To be honest with you. <laughs> True facts. And we have to hear it. We don't want that. 2G. Plus, 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 strong, or plus, plus, green, 85, 2 plus, 63, then you got an 85, 1 minus. The reason I call this a 1 minus, you see how red and clear that is? Right. Very translucent, and the plug, very translucent. You can see right through that plug. Okay. And the more translucent, the better. The more translucent, the better the okay. fish is. Got it. This fish here is the red, the color in this fish looks much better than the color in this fish. Okay. From here, looking at it on camera, right? Right. This fish here is more of a 2G than it is a 1 minus. It's just too dark. Plus plus big eye. 2 100. 2G 73. Plus strong 77. This fish is tricky. 
you got a two, which is kind of a brown in the tail, mm -hmm. but you've got a plug that's beautiful as a two plus. Hmm. So you don't know how that fish is going to cut out. Okay. So what so I you do, mark it down then? I mark this fish down to a two tail with a plus plus. Okay. And then I push it to somebody that'll cut the fish and let me know. Okay. Got it. Plus strong 90. Plus one minus 107. One, 104. That fish is definitely a number one. Yeah, it's beautiful. Clean that color. Definitely the number one. Mm -hmm. 130, one minus. You see a little bit of a difference? Right. Although, you might cut this fish and it might look just as good as this fish. Yeah, they both look very similar. But you can't take the chance. Right. right. We're very strict graders. Okay. Very strict. Very strict. Two plus 90. One minus 120. One minus 90. Plus strong, 89. Plus strong, 75. One minus 80. The reason I call this a one minus, <coughs> although the plug is very translucent, very clear, mm -hmm. the tail is super translucent, super clear. Okay. You can almost think, like if I put my finger behind the meat, you sure. can see it change color. Okay. 109, two plus strong. 121, 2G, 77, 1 minus, 82, looks like it's got some lactic acid burn in it. You see here, there's no translucency in this meat whatsoever. Right. It's yeah. very dark, yeah. it seems like it's burnt. Okay. That's a number two. Okay. That's a big one. 68, 2, 91, plus strong. One minus, 96 plus strong, 99, one minus. That's great. How much fish do you guys move usually a week? I'm usually a week's time, anywhere from 75, anywhere from 50 to 80,000 pounds a week. Wow. And your customers are from all over? Yeah, my, cu my the... customers are basically, we have a small portion of, of customers here locally in Miami. Most of our fish goes all the way up the Northeast. Okay. And into New York and some into the Midwest. Okay. Some into the Midwest. Nice. We move about around 200,000 pounds of tuna. Wow. That's serious. And your fish comes from where? What areas of the... Most the of our fish mostly comes out of Venezuela. Okay. Trinidad. Panama. Costa Rica and Brazil. Okay. I kind of follow the fish. You've got Pacific fish and you've got Caribbean fish. Right. When the fish aren't biting so much in the Caribbean, they're more so in the Pacific. Okay. So I'll turn to Panama, I'll turn to Costa Rica, I'll turn to Ecuador, those countries in the Pacific. And it's a deeper red, it's a different, it's a totally different, that looks beautiful. <coughs> looks, see the board here? Yeah. See what this is, this is probably the first catch from that boat. Okay. We bought the whole boat. Oh, okay. So How many pounds on that boat? That boat was 18,000. Wow. So that boat, we probably just graded, which they first graded the first boxes were the oldest catch of that boat. Okay. So now we're going to the newer catch of the boat and you'll see the difference. Okay, nice. Much, much difference. Yeah, well, this is really a treat. We really appreciate you uh, having us here. Yeah, man, anytime. No yeah. Problem. And then one, one one last question I have for you. That bluefin that we had bought from you guys, yes, uh, what two three weeks ago? Where did that fish come from? That fish came out of Nova Scotia. Okay. And how did you guys end up getting it? That fish came out of Canada. You might want to edit some of this. Okay. There was a big abundance of bluefins being caught. Okay. The prices went to the floor. They had no place to go with them. Okay. So we started bringing a few bluefins here trying to move the product right to try to help the suppliers out. okay i can get that bluefin constantly here, okay but it's not going to be the same price it'll be much more whatever we paid will be more okay okay actually i'm trying to get a hold of the people now so you can talk to them okay but i can bring that we're still grading right here with yeah. tuna in the daylight it's a second batch 2g 122 277 big eye Two plus 55, big eye. Plus strong 80. One minus 115. 
Number two, 122. You see how it's got some red but some brown in it? Right. And if you look at the plug, there's a lot of brown. Okay. Number two, two 137. Two G plus 101. Plus strong, 110. Two G 115. One minus 116. So Chris, I want to say hey, thanks so much for having us here and You're very welcome. inviting us to your company. We're very welcome. You know they say you learn something new every day, you know, <laughs> and uh, we can learn. We learn a lot today. You got more grading going anytime, on here. Anytime I can help you guys or whatever I Yeah, see definitely. Can. No, we appreciate that. Yeah, sure. Of course, you take care of Sergio. Sergio's taking care of us, and uh, the invitation is open anytime. Please come down and enjoy something made by Master Sushi Chef Hiro Tarara. Okay. I still have more fish to grade. <laughs> <laughs> we have a feeling it's going to be going on for a while. This is great. I still we got to grade that? <laughs> we Austin, thanks to you also. Really appreciate that. All right. Appreciate you guys. Absolutely. Thank you. Super right. Austin. We'll see you in the next episode. All right. All right. Thanks. Thanks. Bye bye.